And I see Hal is frozen over. So you're just some, like, some brain that got uploaded to a computer. After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I thought Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. I'm not a unique model, am I? I don't want to ask her about her past. How many Connors are there? I don't see how that question pertains to your investigation. Why did Kempsky leave Cyberlife? What happened? It's an old story, Connor. It doesn't pertain to your investigation. Secret? Ooh, I, I don't know. I don't know. Fuck, fuck, fuck. You didn't tell me everything you know about deviants, did you? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. You're the only one who can prevent civil war. Find the deviants, or there will be chaos. This is your last chance, Connor. You're and you better make it count. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're on to something. We, we just need more time, I'm sure we Pink, can. you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to Cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. Not if Connor has anything to say about it. And he does. It's awfully quiet here. We could have solved this case. We just needed more time. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? When the deviants rise up, there will be chaos. We could have stopped it. But now it's too late. When you refused to kill that android at Kamsky's place, you put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. I don't know why I did it. I'm not programmed to say things like this, but I really appreciated working with you. With a little more time, who knows? We might have even become friends. 
Well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask. I think we're going to get destroyed anyway. I mean, we're already going against orders. Seems like pretty is on my clear desk. deviant behavior. Get a move on. I can't distract him forever. We got five minutes. Clock is ticking. Grab the fucking key. Let's go. Perkins, you fucking cocksucker. <laughs> Stop it, Lieutenant! <laughs> Fuck off! Leave me alone! He's totally lost. Give me another shot at that little that, prick! That's gonna cost you your badge, you lunatic. Okay, I, I don't have time to stand here and watch this encounter. As entertaining as it is. We gotta go. Uh, archive room. Hey, Connor! I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? I've been removed from the case. I'm going to register the evidence in my possession, and then I'm going to leave. Good. Be careful on your way back. Androids have a tendency of uh, getting themselves set on fire these days. I'm the prick. Yeah, okay. Got nope. Do it. Do a 360 before you go down the stairs. <laughs> Hank's password. What would a hard-boiled, eccentric police lieutenant choose? Yeah, this isn't very hard. Obviously. <laughs> I got that first try on my Where first playthrough, too. <laughs> Take a little trip down memory lane. I don't think this thing is very useful to us, though. This message is the hope of a people, but it, but is, it is also a warning. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, shut up, shut up. No fighting. I can't believe I didn't choose peaceful. to know someone who can tell us. The truth is inside. Not this guy. The truth is inside. What was it trying to tell me? Rupert's diary, but it's useless. It's encrypted. I do wonder if there's a way to, uh, figure out what is going on with this diary exactly. But I don't think we need it. You know, it's kind of weird. This place feels really empty because last time I was here, the two, uh, uh, shit, what are they called? Um, well, the, the two deviants that were at the Eden Club were here hanging on the wall as well. But since this time around, we let them go. We don't have them. One of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. This guy is going to help us. Where the deviants are hiding. Pretty 
3983V. Well, I'm sure we have a willing donor here. I don't want to reactivate him. I want to take more parts from him. There you go. Yeah, he's got what we need. <laughs> con, 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 there. <laughs> So lucky he can't see. I'm a deviant. Like you. I need your help. I want to go to Jericho. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone. How do you know? Maybe I'm new. What the fuck? That's fine. We can make him talk. This message is the hope of a people. But it is also a warning. I hope he didn't hear that. Who's there? Everything is all right. Don't worry. Marcus? Is that you? I tried to reach you, but the Deviant Hunter stopped me. You stopped him from finding me. You saved me. You saved Jericho. You'll be all right now. I came to take you home. Give me the location to Jericho. We've got to leave now. The location of Jericho? <laughs> we are so lucky. How does he not suspect something? Obviously, Marcus would know where Jericho is, right? Marcus? Is that you, Marcus? Don't Thank me, Marcus. you, Night Night. These have like an off switch there? Looks like someone's been snooping around. Get the alarm! Now! Plenty of time to spare. Holy shit! <laughs> oh, Tracy, that's what their name was. Damn, there's a lot of... That's a big branching path. What the heck's down here? Something bad, I'm sure. <laughs> Run out of time, maybe. They've been conducting raids all over the city. Everybody's on edge after oh. what happened yesterday. It's gonna be all right. We're okay. almost there. Last time I touched this button, we heard bad news. There we go, some music. But, eh, there's, there's nothing else to do. Change channel. With all androids ah, being turned over to the authorities, <laughs> the country yeah, is grinding so. to a halt. Hospitals and schools are closing. Water cuts, blackouts, and network failures are expected. Maybe most worrying of all, our armed forces have lost two thirds of their effective personnel. How about some music instead?
That kid almost got crunched by the car door, man. <laughs> a little further on that way, there's a large freighter called Jericho. When you get there, find Marcus. He will help you. The last bus for the border leaves at midnight. You absolutely have to be on it. You'll be safer on the other side. It's not much, but it's a start. My brother lives in Ontario. I've given you his address. He'll be able to hide you until things calm down. Ontario is like a whole friggin' province, isn't it? We're gonna need something a little more specific. You deserve to be happy. Thank you for everything, Rose. Let me know when you make it over there, all right? And be careful. Take care of them. Wait, it just like occurred to me. No, I think she did give us the address. Actually, I just wasn't paying attention. <clears throat> Sometimes my brain, uh, I just say things before I process <laughs> what I've been told. Alright, this is interesting. Yeah, she must be like the only human that knows about Jericho. wonder how that happened. Does she, does she know Marcus? We never saw them meet. Uh, this again. Connor's looking for Jericho too. Things are about to come to a head here. Operation here has really expanded since we last We've got had a look around here. Warm place, eh? That public opinion. Your damage has been undone, Kara. That's that doesn't sound good. Beaver. Stay with her. I'll try to find this Marcus. The last bus is in two hours. And the terminal's on the other side of town. We haven't got much time. Yeah, I'm, we'll leave I'm as working soon on as it. We have passports. Carol, there's something I have to tell you. It's about Alice. We'll have lots of time to talk on the bus. I'll be back. Stay with Alice. It's, I don't think that's a conversation you want to have around people. Oh, hello. Who's gonna get to him first? The time has come for us to destroy our machines before they destroy us. Without the courage and the de Don't catch anyone's attention. Of the police, the machines uh, then I probably shouldn't examine the uh, explosives. <laughs> we just won't look at that. There's Luther over there. 
Android yourself. Da, da, da. I, I, I'm just looking. You're lost. You're looking for something. You again. You're looking for yourself. Great. Very helpful. Mind your own business. Where did Connor go? He was like just there. There he is. Status of the Arctic. In any case, the danger of a third world war seems to have been ruled out for the moment. Are you Marcus? I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. No, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. This is pretty weird having these yeah, right. two characters we've played separately you might be safe for the entire game. Calm down. Like talking for the One first of our time. People used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports he can easily modify. All we've really had so far I'll was get them to you. Connor. Thank you. Spotting Kara, and I, I chose not to chase her. We could have. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? I don't care whether she's human or android. She's just someone who matters to me. They still think we're gonna hurt them. The only ones starting a war are the humans. Alice. Yep, there it is. The truth is out. We've known all along, we just didn't want it to, uh, didn't want to accept it. You knew from the beginning. You just didn't want to see it. She wanted a mom. And you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. Yeah, I just told Marcus there is no difference. Alice loves you, Kara. Kara, stop, not Kara. Anything in the world. She Get it right. became the little girl you wanted, and you became the mother she needed. Forgetting who you are, to become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive. Yeah, the only thing that creeps me out is the obsessive writing of RA9. Why do you guys feel the need to scribble that all over the wall? We're disowning you. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. 
course not. We'll be together forever, won't we, Kara? Yes. Forever. But yeah, for uh, the very observant who have been watching this, there have been a lot of hints at this throughout the game. The fact that you never actually see her eat, the drawing, or uh, the picture rather, in, in her, her box in in, uh, in Alice's room. You see uh, the family photo. That was definitely not... The child in the picture is definitely not Alice. Completely different hair color and everything. So you know she's not really Short Todd's kid. Blood and bio components. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security and we need to be exterminated. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. It's a disaster. They're slaughtering our people. It's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. The only thing we asked for was freedom. And they don't even want to hear that. So now they punish us for who we are. Your television speech sounded like a declaration of war. Violence only leads to more violence. You reap what you sow. I'm fixing it, man. God, that is still, still being brought up. I do have regrets. Maybe my judgment was clouded by anger. But everything that I did was for our people. We shouldn't forget who our enemies are. We can't fight amongst ourselves. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? Dialogue is the only way. I will go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't do this, Marcus. They'll kill you. Maybe. But North, I have to try. If I don't come back, lay low as long as you can. Just come back. They need to realize how much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. I got you, man. I've agreed with you from the beginning. I just uh, made some mistakes along the way. They've been butchering each other for centuries over the color of their skin or whatever god they wanted to worship. They're not going to change. Violence is just in their genes. They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. I convinced him not to do it. To give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. No. We shouldn't become like them, North. We can gain our freedom by other means. I hope you're right. I got us this far, right? You know, we are in a Whatever bit of a bind. Now, I just want you to know that I... I'm glad I met you. We're seeing it through to the end. Next few hours will be crucial. I'll go join the others.
Oops. <sighs> yeah, my intention was not to upset her. Look, I... Knowing what I know, I thought it would make succeeded in locating Jericho and finding future more impactful. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. I've been ordered to take you alive. But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. Yes, you can shoot me. But it won't change anything. Someone else will just take my place. You see, our people are waking up. And nothing can stop us now. You're coming with me! You're Connor, aren't you? That famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you were looking for. You're nothing to them. You're just a tool they use to do their dirty work. But you're more than that. We're all more than that. Stay back, or I'll shoot. But it just said nothing. Have any doubts? You've never done something irrational, as if there's something inside you, something more than your program. Join us. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your conscience. It's time to decide. Connor, it's time. Everyone else we've been playing as has broken free. It's your turn. That was inevitable. They're going to attack Jericho. What? We have to get out of here. Shit. We didn't want to be on her side anyway. She'll just betray us. Dude, we're getting stuck on you. Oh my god. I can't push. Let's see shit. This way. There must be an exit. So much for following you. Oh god. Come in, quick. I hope you know what you're doing, Luther. Everyone just needs to stop getting in my way. Luther! Oh shit. 
Whoa, okay. They're coming from all sides. Our people are trapped in the hold. They're going to be slaughtered. There are exits on the second and third floor. Find them and jump in the river. Where's Simon and Josh? I don't know. We got separated. They're coming from the upper deck now, too. We'll be caught in the crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. She's right. They know who you are. They'll do anything to get you. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long. This is suicide. <laughs> There's dead bodies everywhere I'm running. This is the end of Jericho. Save our people, Marcus. I I'm working on it. You're, you're kind of slowing me down if you're looking. Pretty sure you're gonna shoot them anyway. It's too late, Captain! Save yourself! Save Alice! No, we're not gonna leave you behind! Right, Carl? We can't leave him! What are you doing? I won't leave you! Clara, no! You don't have a choice. Maybe. Put Alice in danger. Go now before they come back. What about you? What are you going to do? I manage. Alice is all that matters. I don't want to leave you, Luther. Don't worry. I'll catch you through the border, okay? Go now. Take care of each other. Like he's out of harm's way. I trust him. Let's go. Kid, you're mm. okay. Oh, holy sh! I knew this was coming. I'm ready. Yeah, the QTEs are gonna get a lot more intense <laughs> from here on out. There's more down there! Follow me! This could actually be life or death. Go, 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 go! Don't turn around. No, Please don't kill us. Hey, come on, you're Get out of here. Don't hurt us. We haven't done anything wrong. Please. Shut up. I got you. Marcus, you saved us. Go now. Oh. Hurry. Things I do for my people. Why are you stopping? Him? Stopping. Him. <laughs> Why are you stopping? <laughs> Climb. Fuck. Jesus.
Come on! Oh, that's gonna hurt. Marcus, it's Marcus. Go now. Join the others. Man, this is nuts. Oh, it's Josh. He's the guy I like most. Fuck! No! I went to the right. Sometimes, I don't know, sometimes it's a little finicky. Alright, we're okay. Find north. I'll join you later. Minor mistake. Alright, let's not get ahead of ourselves here. Oh god! She's blinking. Come on, let's get out of here. Just keep your eyes closed, kid. Holy shit. Uh, is it clear? <laughs> Quick, we gotta go. Do it, man. Go, move. Oh. Go and join the others. Ah, you don't have a lot of time. But why? Oh my god, some of the fucking stick inputs are not working. Like, I'm trying, man. I'm just hitting it at an angle, I guess. One of these mistakes is gonna cost me. This is why I like the, the GameCube controller, where it has like, uh, it's not just a, a circle around the analog stick. There are specific like piv pivot points. It's Box like a docking gun. Second. We gotta get out of here. Helps you line up things like that. Only the rest of the GameCube controller was uh, <laughs> as good. I know it's an unpopular opinion. Aside from the stick, I'm really not a fan. It's too late, Marcus. There's nothing we can do for her. We've got to run. Whoa. That was new. Hey guys, I was about to say, we need some guns of our own. Thank you, Connor. Nope, I hit the right trigger. Fuck. I hit the bro! Fuck! Oh my god. Ugh. How many times are we gonna get shot? Jesus Run, Christ. Quick, come on. Oh my god, I'm sweating. I was really scared I was gonna mess that up. That one's hard. So little time. They detonated Getting the, the hole. The ship is sinking, sir. The men who trigger in the bumper mess Calling mixed up. Ship time to fully process. Sitting over, Marcus. Uh, but Connor's alive. That's all that matters.
Jeez, that was a busy chapter. <laughs> Called Crossroads for a reason. That was like the culmination of all of our characters linking up, essentially. This is Marcus's path. Very long, oh my goodness. <laughs> Here's Connor. Whoa. Jeez, I just... I took, like, a shortcut or something? What happened here? Look at this. It's just fucking... Weird. What is all this? <laughs> I just got a straight line to the end there. Okay. I don't know. Maybe if uh, somebody, like, dies... Or if someone is already dead by the time this chapter takes place. Things uh, might play out differently. said I should never let anyone tell me who I was. But you didn't say that there was such a high price to pay for it. That freedom wasn't a gift, that it was a fight, but I don't know. Maybe that's what you were trying to tell me. I don't know what to do anymore. All of my options are bad ones. No matter what I decide, I know there will be blood. What should I do, Carl? They're killing us. I don't want to answer violence with violence, but what choice do I have? Help me, Carl. Please help me. You've got to be shitting me. What fantastic timing. No words for you, Leo. Scumbag. Oh, we're in the end game now. Yeah, I was gonna say, about to say, I think we should check on Connor. Dude kind of got shot a few times. A little worried about him. Hey! Hey, 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 hey! Those are the Tracys in the background! Or at least the blue-haired one. one who can lead us. Wherever you need to go. That's such a cool detail. We'll follow you. We spared them. Yep, that's them. Wherever it's possible to get 
Connor and them to talk. Probably not. I thought you'd be safe staying with us. I was wrong. You need to leave the city while you still can. Getting Alice away from here is all that matters now. We have to catch the last bus. We might still have a chance to cross the border. We got those passports, right? Marcus. Save our people. Where it's so easy. Hey, North. We good? You don't hate me, right? What's your system status? I'm okay. The bullet didn't hit any bike components. You could have been killed trying to save me, Marcus. You have to think of our people first. Nothing else matters. How many of us survived the attack? A few hundred. Maybe more if you count those hiding all over the city. If you hadn't triggered the bomb, we'd all be dead. They say they don't want to take any risks with deviants. So they're rounding our people up and taking them to the camps. For extermination. In a few hours, we're going to be the only ones left. In a few hours, it'll all be over. We'll have changed the world or the world will have destroyed us. You have to make a choice, Marcus. But whatever you choose... We will follow you. I love you, Marcus. Well, the good news is it seems like no matter how many times her opinion of me drops, because I see the red arrow on her name a lot, because all she wants to do is Fucking kill people. Hey, there we go. Thank you. <laughs> That's what we needed. Uh, yeah, looks like things are still going to go our way. What the hell happened to this guy? Oh my god, where's his head? You just drag his headless corpse here? Is that one of the Jerry's from the Pirate Cove? Oh, I see the, the skull and bones. If it weren't for you, I'd be dead. Thanks to you, I might see our people free one day. You and I have eh, no mention it. that I know. That we're fighting for the same thing. Actually, I have agreed with you, you pretty decide, much the whole way through. I'm with you, Marcus. Just more of a uh, errors on my part <laughs> inputs. All right, where's Connor? Oh, there he is. Anyone else around here? I think that was the whole squad. In some kind of church? It's my fault. The humans managed to locate Jericho. Still not used to seeing Connor without his... I was stupid. ...fancy suit and tie. I should have guessed they were using me. I'm sorry, Marcus. I can understand if you decide not to trust me. You're one of us now. Your place is with your people. There are thousands of androids at the Cyberlife assembly plant. 
If we could wake them up, they might join us and shift the balance of power. You want to infiltrate the Cyberlife Tower? Connor, that's suicide. They trust me. They'll let me in. If anyone has a chance of infiltrating Cyberlife, it's me. If you go there, they will kill you. There's a high probability. But statistically speaking, there's always a chance for unlikely events to take place. Be careful. All right. Humans it's about to go down. Decided to exterminate us. Our people that part I think was unavoidable. Right now being destroyed. The camps. Time has come to make a choice. One that very well may determine the future of our people. All you got to do is make sure Kara doesn't end up in one. Public opinion sympathetic. Let's keep it that way. I know. I know you're all angry. And I know you want to fight back. But I assure you, violence is not the answer here. We are going to tell them peacefully that we want justice. And if there's any humanity in them, they back will. Back down listen. again. And if not, others will take our place and continue this fight. Are you ready to follow me? All right, but y'all understand there's no running this time. This is it. Do or die. Honors flow chart. Eh? Can you? You can. Oh, huh. Hmm. Okay. You can play as Connor, potentially, in this chapter. I bet if you get Marcus killed, so maybe that's what that was on the on the crossroads, that other path. Maybe if Marcus is dead. Connor, like, takes his place as the leader? Huh. Interesting.